Right, so this is a back-to-back -back ride with the lower shock. I have done 800 miles with the standard shock. So this is the first ride with the short shock. <laughs> short shock, it's a mouthful, isn't it? So, fitting the shock wasn't too bad. Just need a bit of a gentle persuasion, getting the uh, lower part in. But fairly straightforward. I'm not gonna fit the bushes, uh, the spacers in the front shocks. That's definitely not a full extensive test, but as it's the following day and I'm taking it on the same route I did yesterday, I thought I'd uh, put the camera on. Just give a little explanation after the install video. Not the first impressions really. So it's definitely lower. I, I can completely flat foot this now. It's only 25 millimeters lower, but I was used to be on the balls of my feet and it's just enough for me to confidently come to a stop through traffic. So a massive improvement really on that aspect when you're, if you're on your tiptoes and you're going through traffic and that, the rear shock is definitely a good investment. And this will also give Joe a little bit more confidence going off-road because we found on the BMW GS, the uh, 310 that Joe had, the bike wanted to go more to the right because the stand was so long it would hit the floor so you'd have to lean it away from you to get the stand on. Where this is a shorter stand, you don't have to do that. So it's good on that part as well. Right, so that is just a quick video. I did search YouTube before I fitted this shock and I couldn't find anything showing you how you take the shock off. It's fairly straightforward. That's probably why no one's done a video on it. But I thought, you know what, I'll, I'll make one on it and talk about it. So I appreciate you watching. Please give me a thumbs up to let me know if you enjoyed the video. Then I'll make more like this. Subscribe for more. Plenty of content with the KTM 390 Adventure. This is now my wife's bike. So until then, I've been Nick, and I'll catch you on the next episode. Ride safe.